Yo, what is up guys, Shotgun here, and welcome back to another video. So today, guys, I have something really special in store for you guys, as you guys can probably tell by the title. So today, guys, uh, it was even today, actually, I bought it a few days ago, but I actually bought this golden knife. So this golden knife right here, I bought it for about, actually, I won't even get into the details just yet, because I have the little clip of me buying it, so you guys can see why I traded and everything for it. But, I actually did want to sell this golden knife, so I've actually, I think this is my 7th or 8th golden knife on this, on this realm, at least, and... I guess I'm kind of tired of using these because I've used a few of them. I've, I think I gave my last one away, yes. And yeah, it's basically more or less, yeah, I basically used them or gave them away. And for this one, I did want to give it away again. But the thing with that is that the last person I gave it away to, he was basically a nub. And he basically started selling the knife. I think he sold it for 50 mil instead of actually using it or maybe selling it for basically three times as much. Which we could He could have squeezed that much out of the knife, to be completely honest. But... Yeah, I don't know, he basically sold it for a third of what he could have sold it for, so that was kind of his mistake, but to be honest, I don't really want that to happen again, because then it gets into the hands of someone good, and then obviously, even the guy who had this knife wanted to knife me, so yeah, honestly, it just comes down to knifing me at the end either way, because I've seen so many people with knives wanting to knife me, but for some reason it hasn't happened, I mean, I have been knifed, but it hasn't happened yet for a little while, I guess, but apart from all of that, with this knife, I actually do want to go ahead and knife Necro, so you guys are probably thinking I'm trying to knife the guy who's named Necro on here, I think there is a guy called Necro V, I do believe, but I'm not trying to knife him, I'm literally going to knife the freaking boss for 10k subs, because... I know this isn't like, this isn't too big of a thing to do for 10k, so I'm also going to be doing something like a Q&A, not too sure. And this will be like a little extra thing where I just knife the necro, so I think we're only about 80 something subs away, so I'm not too sure how long it'll be until we hit that. Yeah, legit, once it comes up, I'm literally just going to go to it and freaking one-shot the necro, so that's actually going to be so intense. So hopefully, I'm honestly not too sure what some people are going to say about it. Maybe I'll actually knife a naked person, I'm not even sure, but... I just want to do something stupid with this knife. Yeah, I just want to be this first person to do this with a knife. I guess nobody else has knifed the necro on the server yet. And also, I'm also the f I think I am the first one to give away the knife. So, I don't know, I'm kind of rewriting history on the server. Not rewriting, making history on the server, even though it's some pointless history. Something that nobody cares about, but still, I just want to knife necro because I can. And I guess we gave our last one away, so there's no point even trying to give it away again. Because I don't want the same thing to happen, so guys... That's the deal here. 10k subs and I'll go knife Necro. And hopefully I can't hit that before, I guess, whenever next season starts. Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and PV the knife out But now. But guys, I think this will probably be like the second thing I do for 10k apart from my, I guess, Q&A or whatever I do. Because 10k is a lot of freaking subs. And I honestly do appreciate the support I've had all the way up till now. And I guess even recently, the support has been really insane. So I just want to say thanks to you guys for that. Even though I don't say that much, honestly, I do appreciate it. Yeah, I guess I probably should save all of that for when I actually hit 10k and not this video because this video i guess is dedicated to a treasure wars episode and that golden knife man that was i guess we got really lucky there because even in the last episode i do believe it was yeah it should have been the last episode we actually saw the guy in chat actually get the golden knife mid recording and we ended up hitting him up and i guess he was really genuine about it before i actually show you guys the clip of me trading for the knife i do need to say something so this guy that I traded the knife to, I gave him my dragon pet, that was one of the items I gave him. I overpaid a lot for this knife, but honestly I don't care because I guess we're approaching the end of the season and I have a lot of money to throw, I have a lot of sets, I have all of that stuff. I honestly don't have to worry about any of that, but I guess it doesn't really matter to me that I paid, overpaid for it. But the dragon pet I gave him, he actually ended up getting scammed out of it, which was so stupid. There's literally nothing we could do about his dragon pet, which was so bad, man. But apart from all of that, guys, here is the clip of me actually trading him the stuff for the golden knife. So right guys, now I'm actually at a shop and I'm actually going to go ahead and trade my stuff out, all of this stuff over here for a freaking golden knife, so I actually don't even need this knife, but I decided to actually go for it anyway just because I'm planning to do something really special for it and you guys will see that soon, because I guess my last experiment failed where I actually gave away that knife, I actually had plans for what I wanted the guy to do with the knife, but it doesn't actually turn out he did it, and it looks like he just cancelled the trade or something, I don't know what's going on there. I don't know what this guy is doing, he's examining it or something, dude, it's legit, here, I'll just show you guys, see, so, all of this freaking stuff, dragon pet as well, I'm a freaking highest level IG pet, because, I guess my other one's only like two levels below, so it doesn't matter too much, and bang, golden knife boys, holy freaking crap, oh my god, we've got the golden knife guys, alright guys, now I'm actually at nether, because we have another derp I do want to test out, so I'm going to quickly show you guys this derp as soon as we can get someone to, I guess run into it, so if I can write in chat, that's for nether for pvp and i do believe nobody apart from me vic and lachlan have a knife right now so if somebody does have a knife it's gonna be kind of depressing because right now i don't really want to focus on dodging a knife right now 
Okay, yeah, I didn't mean to do that. But right now, I just want to focus. I'm trying to lead someone into this dub because we've got two new ones now. Because the last one, I guess I showed you guys the best one on the server so far, I do believe. I mean, it's not it's not too great, but it's like it's hidden so well that makes it so good. And like, it's so easy to lure people into it, which is what I really like about it. Yeah, hopefully we can do something about that in a little bit and try to get someone into one of those devs because that would be really cool. So yeah, guys, I threw a message in chat. And there's a lot of people here, but nobody seems to be running out right now. And also... Oh god, uh, if I can see a huge faction here that wants to try and gank me, I'm not going to be too happy. It looks like I have someone on me and this guy just ran straight back in. Now, what's the freaking point of that? And this guy just keeps hitting me so you can die as well. This is brutal. He's not even truced me or anything. I'm not sure if he wants to attack me. Yeah, here he goes. This guy is just going to come straight for me. Let's go ahead and jump this guy. So it looks like they're both going for me. One guy is, I guess, trying to... I can I still on the... One guy is actually trying to purge me and the other guy is trying to... I guess just try and tear down my armor a little bit, but he did basically no damage, so <laughs> not even sure what's going on over there. Please run out again, guys. I need someone to actually fight. And there you go, we've got Brutal right here. So this guy apparently has a 40 lore as well, which is, I guess, would be pretty cool if we could grab that. He's on 26 right now, so let's actually try and lead him out. Yo, please don't. Oh, he fell in and he's on 22, man. I think he just IG paid or something, because there's no way he was on that. And this guy over here, we've got a lot of action going on right now as well. So can I lead one of these guys into the depths? Uh, okay, that guy seems to have... Okay, is he going to follow us? Oh, no, let's actually try and run. Yeah, okay, he's following me. Yeah, he's actually following me. Uh, yo, no, dude. He's actually following me. I didn't mean to run in there, by the way. Uh, uh, holy crap, is he still going to follow me? Oh, my God, dude. Now I need to get out of here. Is he, yo, come on, dude. Take the bait. Oh, he didn't take the bait, man. Rip. And this guy isn't going to take the bait either. Oh, so there's another guy there, but honestly, I don't want to try to chase this guy in. Let's see how many hearts he has, to be honest. He has 32. So, can I hit it? I probably hit this guy and she just step over here, to be completely honest. <laughs> oh, we almost got him. Okay, I don't want to stay anywhere near here. He's on 41. Can we actually get this guy in the hole as well? Oh, they have one depth there, but it looks like this guy actually pulled a bit back up. So, rip, rip. So this step, man, it kind of somewhat obvious that we're trying to lure people in trick because when I jump off that huge thing and instead of actually getting hit off it, kind of, I guess, attracts people to it. But this guy over here, man, what is his name? I've never even seen him around. Maybe he changed his name because, oh, God, I've still got these two guys on me again. And my resistance is still on. Okay, that's good. And uh, can any of these guys try and chase me? Oh, you can die, dude. Uh, yeah, these guys don't really seem to be chasing me, which kind of does annoy me because I do want to try and dab someone, man. Please, just let me get one dab kill. Uh, these guys are running back, so I guess they are pretty aware of my dab. So I'm just going to show you guys them before I actually try and dab someone because if we don't actually end up dabbing someone, then I guess it's pretty ripped. So let's just go down here. And the first step over here is uh, I guess I kind of showed you guys somewhat the way you're meant to go. So if I go all the way down here, I actually am meant to jump into the hole over here. And then I do believe I head straight over here, yeah. It should be straight down here. So this is the gateway dub. So we can just run down here and just quickly like just lock the person up in there. Just get in here and basically just grind the hell out of them. Or I guess just go straight through here. Head over here and just quickly just dash home or whatever you want to do to get out of here. And then if I actually... Let me go back to the warp nether. So there's another dub that's... I guess I probably should have shown that one off first because it's literally right next to you and it takes an effort to get you. But this dub is the actual dub that we're supposed to use. But it's not concealed or anything meaning... It's going to be really, really hard to try and hit anyone into the dub down here. So if you just go straight over here and just go straight through here, you guys can see this is the next step. So on this step, I'm not going to go down because it's going to tag me into combat. But obviously, you can't get away from this step. There's literally no way to get away from it, which is, I guess, really cool for us. But these guys seem to have jumped down or something. Oh, oh yeah, it looks like he actually, that's MK. Uh, looks like he actually ended up all the way back up, which doesn't help me out or... Yeah, it looks like they were basically just running away at this point, so it would be really cool if you could try to lure one of these guys into the dev, because honestly, I think that would be a big plus for us to grab another set, obviously we're going to have to split between us, because these guys are letting me use their dev and whatnot, can I just one-shot this guy, and I didn't even one-shot him, that's kind of embarrassing, uh, <laughs> this guy is literally, <laughs> I could have hacked this guy, but the thing is, yo, okay, these guys want to catch some hands, no way, dude, he's going to run back in, let's just say whatever to him, uh, this guy, to be honest, he doesn't seem to be hitting me, so I'm not even going to bother with him. But if he runs, if he like follows me down there, I actually definitely deserve him. So, I mean, <laughs> it's kind of factions, and 
Um, the only reason I'm not attacking him is because... Wait, okay, that's MK. Oh, wait, no, that is MK. I meant to be attacking this guy here. Yo, I just freaking... Yo, I almost dropped out of my health boost starts there for a second. Okay, let's stay on this guy. Let's keep everyone inside the nether at least. So, right, guys. Now, I'm actually at net crew because it just came up. And I'm with some of the ally faction members. So, I got all of these guys. So, I guess hold the net crew down. And then me and this guy over here is also in the ally faction. I'm trying to get our 5% hits in. Just to kill this guy off and get our crates. So... Holy crap man, I'm trying so hard not to fall off and okay I'm sorry dude but I'm gonna have to do this. Let's go around so I can get some hits in shoot because I need my 5% dude. Yeah what are you doing? I need my 5%. Okay this is actually getting harder because he keeps moving but I also can't jump because if I jump then he's literally gonna hit me out of position. And now I guess we should let him get his hits as well. So I'll just wait there for a little bit. Let him pound some hits in. He's actually doing a lot of damage to him. He's doing a lot of damage for not shifting and propping his execute for... I think he's gotten enough hits in and just in case, I'm just going to put some hits in myself. And there you go guys, we've grabbed ourselves the Mythic Blue Crate and I also grabbed myself a... I guess Nether Star, so honestly I didn't need that, but... I'm quickly turn my fly on and get out of here, so... Okay, there you go, that's how you get hit back into combat ASAP. So right now nobody seems to be heading into our depth, which is kinda... I guess it's kinda sucky, but it's whatever, so... I mean, <laughs> he, really, he really wants to run into a depth, that's really the thing here, but I don't know, we'll see what happens, and I guess we'll just carry on from there. So right guys, I actually have the Mythic Creep for me, so I'm just going to quickly open this guy up before I actually head back in there, and we've got Kill Confirm 3, Petrify 1, which is both really bad for us, so nah, don't need any of those. Stealth 3 and Holy Tree, and nah, I don't need any of that either. Helpful to do protect the tree, okay, yeah, we're honestly not getting anything, but yeah, that's, this is so bad. I'm not dealing with any of that stuff, so let me just quickly put my IG pet back there. I also have another one in my PU, but I think I may open that one up at the end, instead of opening it up now. So, okay, we've got the only light here, so this guy has like a dragon pet and whatnot, I'm pretty sure. So if we can actually try and drop this guy, we're actually stay on him. Wait, where is he? I honestly can't even see, man. Right, okay, guys, I actually think I'm probably going to mention this now instead of mentioning it, I guess, in future episodes, because I actually am going to talk about it soon. He's on 16. Yo, this dude's on 16. There's no way. Is he wearing a max set? Yo, wait, wait, wait. let me actually quickly try and drop this guy. Oh, 16, and he's fallen back in. I don't think he's wearing a max set. Anyone who would have actually had a set would not actually enter here with 16. This guy actually seems to be hitting me as well. I should stay on him. Heat Meister is also here, so looks like everybody's here for some PvP this time around. Maybe they're actually rolling for me because they know I have the knife, but obviously after this episode goes up, I don't think anybody should be running because, like I said, I definitely am going to knife Necro out. 10k subs, so I guess that is pretty... Oh god. Okay, yeah, this guy is still on 13. But yeah, guys, what I'm actually planning to say for this is... I'm going to be making a suggestion on the forum soon, should I guess make it a lot more professional rather than talking about it with I guess staff members or owners, whatever you want to say. Because if you write it on the forums, obviously they kind of have to look at it. They don't have to, but I guess it's way more professional and I guess they'll have a better chance of actually happening. So I'm actually planning to, I guess, put up a whole thread on the forums about suggestions. And so it's basically going to be stuff like remove eye patch. I guess we can execute to the point where we're only pokes when you're behind the person because I know it happens right now like that, but... I guess I only want to chat like that because I don't like this whole shift PvP thing. I maybe even dedicate a whole video to it. I'm not even sure yet, but I don't like this whole shift PvP aspect of everything. So I really want people to actually be able to stray people to fight them and whatnot. So we're going to make a whole suggestion about that on the forum sometime soon. See if we can actually get that chat in because I really want blindness removed. So eye patch and whatnot, captain removed. I also want. I guess execute debuff to the point where, I guess like I said, you can only proc from behind, so this actually makes treasures raw again. So you literally have to strafe people, so crushing and stuff obviously is still in effect. And they may have to debuff some stuff to actually make it so that you can be killed, because I guess once they do what I just said there, it may be hard to kill people, and it's really really hard to kill people, so they're probably going to have to, I guess, enough a lot of custom in chance to bring, I guess, hitting people down to... I guess an actual possibility so we'll see how that goes but definitely i'm going to be looking into i guess changing treasure rules a little bit making a few suggestions but obviously i don't, I don't know if it'll happen maybe it will but i guess if we all actually i guess agree to and whatnot i'll talk about in a future video about how you guys can actually help me out with that and if you guys want to see it happen how you guys can i guess make it happen so talk about in the future about how you can do that on the forums and i make the thread but based on with i'm going to be doing stuff like that we completely change treasures pvp change all of that stuff and i guess make it so much better easier and i guess a lot more fun so yeah i'll see how all of that stuff goes but honestly you guys should be hyped for that we're going to completely try and change it obviously like i'm saying we're going to try because there's probably no 
I don't think it'll happen just because it's kind of a huge change. Yeah, basically everyone's gone now. But yeah, it would be really cool if we could get something like that done. And holy crap, as soon as I came in, everyone's here again. But oh my god, the gang boys, the freaking gang. But yeah, holy yeah, there's a lot of these guys. But it would be really cool if you guys could, I guess, could just come together and try to change a few things. I guess everyone complains about on the server because I guess it really is our trust. We want something changed by a point suggestion thing on the forums, which is, I guess, what a lot of people miss when they complain about stuff. They never really suggest it or anything. They don't really want it changed enough to suggest it. So I guess for us, I really want like the whole shift PvP thing gone. So that's what I'm going to try and change. If you guys want it gone too, you guys can definitely try and help. Or I guess anything else I suggest. If you don't want any of that stuff to happen, then you can just disagree with the post, this whatever. Maybe just leave something that I could change about it. So I guess make it a little bit better. Or I guess to fit in whatever you want to happen to the server. So this guy, they're all right here, but. This guy needs freaking kills, so let's go straight on him, boys. <laughs> no, I don't even know if they're all gonna go for me now. Uh, he's run straight back in, and this guy's going straight on me, too. So let's go and Oh, 21 already. Yep, we need to stay on this guy. Where is he? Heat sink. No, that's not even him. I don't even know his name. I think it's the Heat Meister. He ran back in, dude. But yeah, I guess if it happens, it's pretty cool. And if it doesn't, I guess it's whatever. But for the most part, right now, nobody really. Holy crap, this guy's about to lag out. Right, that is good. He just got in safe soon, and there's a whole lot of people freaking hitting him there. That would have been so bad. And my gear's pretty low, so I think I'll just run back in for now. I'll quickly fix everything up. So, obviously, I always am keeping an eye on my gear at the bottom left. I don't usually say stuff when it's about to break, but I guess when it's at this point, I probably should. So, let's quickly do that. Throw this guy, these stuff out. Then my fly back on. Okay, I can't put fly on yet, but. Wait, is my. Yeah, there you go. My jump is on. And I guess it says there anyway, so let's go and just head out here. So any of these guys want to challenge me once again. Right now, it doesn't really seem like I can even lure one person into the derp, which is so bad. But if we do do a derping episode for the next episode, we 100% will derp someone. There's no doubt about it, because if we don't derp someone, then I'm not going to freaking use that video, unless something really cool happens. So, yo, we just got this guy down here. Can we? Yo, no way. Oh, nah, dude. That's... Oh, okay, that sucks. We can't even get him, so I guess that's whatever. I'm not even sure if he's gonna go for me or okay I guess we'll call it slight or whatever but these guys all seem to be I guess just sitting in there so I guess we are pretty good for now oh any of these guys are gonna come out ever there's like so many of them none of them want to actually go for me what the hell dude yo I'm being freaking tagged right now I'm literally getting played with all right let's go right on brutal and nah, he's on 29 right now I don't know why we literally just keep shifting at each other and then every other second we're just straight on each other trying to kill each other again but literally treasure was mine this is how the treasure was literally the treasure was experienced right here uh these guys I don't even know who I'm hitting anymore this is another thing I want to change the freaking particles man I don't like the particles in your pvp it's so annoying I want all of that stuff to remove from the screen should I actually make it so that I guess you can see who you're fighting because I don't know, it's so annoying trying to pee if you like this. This guy seems to try to pull it all the way up over here. Let me quickly try to jump on him. So it looks like. Oh, he's on 32 right now. He just pointed me off as well, but I don't really need the pot. Uh, I really want one of these guys to follow me in the depth. Okay, and now if I can just try to run and just jump all the way down. Oh, he's already gone off on me, so I guess it may be in a cool right now. And just thinking about. I guess just talking about what I'm trying to do right now. So. Don't want to try and derp Sly because I'm cool with him and I'm pretty sure he also got derp there once before and he got out so he probably knows where I would try to lead him if I was derping. But I guess it is also an easy escape route for us which is dope so uh, we've got this guy yeah he doesn't really seem to have a set on so this is bad man there's literally nobody here to actually fight in child or I guess just hit in child derp. Uh, I'm just gonna carry on hitting on to this guy then because I really want to get him armor, his armor down and possibly get a quick drop on him and try and kill him. So right now guys it doesn't really seem like anybody's running out. I'm not even sure what just happened there. My thing just glitched but really nothing is happening. This guy just keeps coming out like, literally. He's the only one that even tries to fight me. He drops kind of easily which is kind of confusing. Maybe he doesn't have his sap for the maxed out but apart from that man he's like the only one jumping out. We can't even get him to die which sucks. We dropped him down to 16 and whatnot but instantly He's teleporting right back to I guess this area over here where he's instantly teleporting out. And this guy is freaking attacking now. I can't let you attack MK dude. It doesn't work like that. Oh god, so I'm gonna have to break my truce with him just to save MK. But alright, there you go. Uh whose things are these? These are sly foxes. But all in all, it's only him running out. So I think I may just leave this area because it's actually getting kind of bland just sitting here. Cause honestly, I can't even derp anyone like this because most of the people I guess it's kind of obvious I'm running to a derp because literally I'm willingly jumping off over here where there's a few derps are like literally outlined down there but for the most part uh it's that okay that's my but yeah literally even right now I'm looking this guy is here still but we've got a slide down there okay no he's actually gonna jump back out we just hit him right back in dude you don't even deserve <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, watch this. This is actually something really cool that my friend wants. Okay, it didn't work. Okay. All in all, guys, I think I probably will wrap up the episode here. So I'm just going to get out of this area. Because honestly, I don't want to just sit here and do some bland PP when nobody's even running out. It actually gets so annoying when you fight like that. So I'm just going to head back to spawn. But guys, hope you guys did enjoy today's episode of Treasure Wars. Now, I have that thread and whatnot linked. Probably next Saturday because... I really need that thread to get looked at and I guess I really need time to I guess, set everything up. Probably won't write it myself just so I can get someone who's really good at it. I guess using the forums and whatnot she write it. But I'll talk more about that stuff later once it's complete and everything. So guys, if you did enjoy today's episode of Treasure Wars, be sure to leave a like, subscribe to me. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out everyone.